Tonight, Wyoming police are stepping up warnings about a man trying to entice and attempting to kidnap children near an elementary school there. Now, that escalated warning comes on the same day that police arraigned a man for enticing children near a Deer Park school. With new information your family needs to know, 9 News reporter Bill Price is live tonight in Wyoming. Bill? Well, Carol, we're in front of the uh, Hilltop School, and Wyoming police, in fact, have just posted this notice on the city's website, all to try to warn parents about the attempted enticement incident that occurred here. Police say a man tried to lure a girl into his shiny red pickup truck around 8 a.m. last Thursday as she was walking to the Hilltop School. The girl reported the man asked her if she wanted to see a puppy he had inside the pickup. Fortunately, the girl said no and ran. This is a serious incident. Um, you know, we want the children in the community to know the right thing to do when something like this happens. And we certainly don't want kids to approach a vehicle, you know, with a stranger in it, someone that they don't know. Wyoming parents are also taking the incident seriously by talking with their children about strangers. I would be anxious about this. This is something I don't think about because I want them to be independent and I want them to walk to school and I want them to do all of that. And I still, I'll still encourage them to do all of that. And it's very upsetting, but I think the nice thing about the community here is that people really are very close knit. We watch out for each other. Um, the whole community is like a neighborhood watch. And we just have to be even more cautious. And families are also on guard on the east side following a series of child enticement incidents around the Amity School on East Galbeth Road in Deer Park. Two sisters aged 10 and 11 reported seeing a man trying to get them into his car on at least three occasions last week. 18-year-old James Loman of Sycamore Township is now under arrest, facing six counts of criminal child enticement. He's being held on a $600,000 bond. We encourage the kids to, to run for help, to scream and yell, um, to get as far away from the stranger as possible. Now, Wyoming elementary schools have already sent home notices to parents about the incident here. And Wyoming police are encouraging uh, parents or anyone in town to call them if they happen to notice that shiny red pickup truck or see any suspicious activity around the school. Bill Price, 9 News, live in Wyoming.